Hello folks, today I'm gonna to show you how to get your guitar from sounding like this to this. Stay tuned. Hello folks, this is your friend Cesar Benzoni. Welcome back to my channel. This channel is all about musical instrument, equipment and country music. So if you like content like this, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I'm gonna show you how I get a country guitar tone in the box inside a computer with a THU uh, plugin. It's a plugin that is included in the Slate Digital subscription, is the one I have. So if you are subscribed in the Everything Bundle from, from Slate, you have this, this plugin already. This tone I'm going to show you is the result of years of research uh, by listening to albums, listening to stems, getting raw tracks from, from friends in Nashville and listening to classic country records and trying to get as close as possible to those raw tracks. So we are here inside Reaper and the first thing in the change for a country tone is the guitarist, first of all, and second for me it's a Telecaster. This one is a Mexican Fender with Lindy Freling pickups. Uh, you can see the review I did for those pickups uh, here in the cards. They are lovely. And so here we have the THU Slate version open. So this week is my birthday and I'm going to give you this exact preset as a gift for you. You just need to find an empty preset here, an empty slot. Click with the right button, import file, and you have this here. Country Dark Face, that's the one that you are gonna load. And you find exactly the same thing you are seeing here in the chain I have. I can close this now. In the chain you have a compressor, we have a tube screamer that I'm not gonna use it, but uh, I'll show you how I would use it though. Um, delay, a slapback delay, a fender blackface type of amp. This is the cabinet. This one is a impulse response loader. Y you can't load your own impulse response, but they have a library here with loads of impulse response. They are great. The impulse response, if you're not familiar with what it is, it is an actual representation of the of the real cabinet and the mic. It's not a it's not algorithm, it's not emulating, it's the actual uh, response of that amp with certain type of mic. Here I have an EQ and a spring reverb. You can change everything in the chain here. You have the all the amps, all the cabinets. If you have the THU that is not the 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 full one, not the slate one, then you would be able to to put your own IRs into into any of those cabinets here. And here we have the effects and pedals. So I'll turn everything off. Ah, oh, one, one cool thing about this dark face and, and all the other tube amps is that you can click the gear and you can change the tube in the preamp and in the power amp. You can change the voltage and yeah, I found this combination the best for this type of tone, but I recommend you trying uh, for yourself. And everything else, I'm, I'm just showing you a start off point and that will give you a good result, but you can change things over and see if you find it anything that, that you might like it better. And you can also leave in the comments below if you did something different that you like better. Uh, so turn it off. That's how it sounds straight in the computer, straight into my Apollo interface. <laughs> Let's turn the amp on. Way live, livelier. Uh, but one thing I'm doing that is interesting in this compressor, it is compressing. I'm having way more uh, sustain of the note and also I have more snap of the attack, but also I'm cranking the level up so I can send a good amount of signal into this dark face that the volume is already in 10. So I'm, I'm having more of the, the grit from the tubes. So here it is. Without.
Second thing, slap back delay. You see, it's just a, a, a quick response. You might adjust the time according to the song you're playing, but this one... Okay, let's continue here. And if you're playing more like a Don Rich type of sound, something older, uh, you might consider turning the bass down maybe. Let's see, we have in four. Here. Turn it back on. Oops. And here I have a, a parametric EQ boosting 5 dB in 5.25k. Let's hear how it sounds. Without. You see, it just adds more presence, more, more of the grit of the tubes from the amp, because I'm uh, boosting that ap after the amp. So, again, without. With. Lovely. And. To give a bit more ambience, there's a lovely spring reverb here. Just turn off the delay so you can hear. Lovely reverb. Without. Super dry and no fun at all. With everything. <laughs> There's this lovely overdrive coming from the tubes. If I want uh, more overdrive still, I can use the tube screamer here. If you're playing more like a southern rock or a rockier country. <laughs> pedal that I use is called Sparkle Drive and it's nice because it is kind of a similar to a Tube Screamer uh, circuit but you have a blend knob so you can have some of that dirt coming in but the clean signal going as well so it's gorgeous you can't do with this one. You will see I have a, I have a full video on how to get a country guitar tone in the box uh, for free if you don't have the, the THU slate. So you can check that out, and in that video I do a trick that I can blend the Tube Screamer in. So let's hear with the neck pickup. to the bridge pickup. If you want a cleaner sound, you can come to the volume, just lower it up a bit. turn the level down here but I like uh, for this type of sound that we're aiming for I like it all the way up So that's how you can get a country guitar tone in the box inside your computer with the THU Slate version. 
So if this video helped you, please consider helping me by subscribing to the channel and help this video to reach more people that, like you, are interested in country music and country instruments. Also, you can follow me on Instagram where I post tips and tricks on my story and where we can interact. And also, if you want to work with me, hit me a message on www.yodelstudio.com. We now have a lovely blog uh, talking about the recordings we do here in the studio, talking about the artists that, re that record here with us. So that's pretty cool. Thanks very much for watching. I wish you a lovely day and we'll see you next time.